been in the field several days. This is the first time I've ridden out to the field with Jim though. It's our final day. Today is June 20th and it's day... What day we are we start, on? We started this process of leaving home a week ago today. So we made two trips down here and hopefully we'll finish our job today. And I think it's day eight of harvest. What's he do? Cuts right in front of me, and I just T-bone him. <laughs> Poor little guy. Let's see, though, what did you tell me yesterday? It was too hot to live. <laughs> He's probably suffered anyway. <laughs> One thing about it, there's plenty of deer in the wall. Well, this is true. <clears throat> okay, so now you it's obvious what you got to do here, right? Yep. Oh, and there's still a little bit over on their side, too. I, I a can't, little bit. I can't quite tell for certain. Yeah, there is. All right. It'll take longer to cut out the terraces than the whole field. Those are steep little devils. And you got to try to clean this little mess up. We about got her whipped though. The only thing it'd be is I don't. Okay, unless he would have us cut what we could east of his dad's house. Well, we'll just have to see, you know? Yep.
this looking? Yeah, this this right here is ready. So this is just full of straw and debris. Just full. It's that my release door is open. all the black marks I put on here, all the black marks are headed towards the center. Yep. When you're standing around not thinking about anything else, you should always look at them because those marks will look to tell us if the bolts are coming loose. Okay. Green is on the red truck. I can't remember if it's two full loads or one full one and one almost full. I think it's just a it's just a partial load and a full load. So I'm gonna guess one one more full load will probably fill it. Try then I just got to get back to send you all those pictures again. Yeah, just send me a picture and I'll be fine. Okay, yeah. I'll let you go. Thank you. Okay, you bet. Yeah, bye. bye. Happy Father's Day. Thank you. Um, wonder how many Father's Days you've spent in the field. Most of them. <laughs> probably, probably. Hell yeah, most of them. I guess we weren't doing on the road stuff with Jamie and Jenna much till 1990 so probably pretty much after that well you were on the road though on Father's Day before that only 30 years 30 plus <laughs> yeah but you bought we bought the first combine 39 years ago already
Yeah, someday I'm going to cut back on the amount of machines I run. <laughs> That's a pretty good joke. How come you never went to more than one? Because I didn't want more than one. You're getting to cut the best wheat that we've cut up here. You want me to get out? No. Nope, it's just fine. And you know something I think about that's comical is when I was 18 years old and a hired man for your grandpa, that first summer he had, we had four combines. And I remember them talking about some friends of theirs from Grand Island that ran one combine. And I, for the life of me, couldn't believe somebody would run one combine. How in the world would that work? And then that's what we've done for almost 40 years, had one combine. <laughs> I think about that. Or do you think about people that in our in our last 40 years telling you that it'll never last, never make it work? Well, we certainly didn't get wealthy. No, but we made a living. Raised some pretty good kids on the road that know how to work. Step is the big cleanup. Jim's just cutting the stubble pretty short so that we don't have to deal with tall stubble while we're on the ground and cleaning. Discipline ourselves. I really do intend on not be doing perfection, but I know how both both of us are. It's hard to it's hard to not do a great job. Yeah, you can't just do a partial job. It's hard to do a half-ass job. I sure wouldn't want the weeds from what we've just cut. So we try to do as good of a job as we possibly can.
Shading up just a little bit for a little while. A few minutes. Don't worry, safety fans. The header lock is down. Yep. It's down. That's next. All oh, that's got to come out. Much better. Didn't even take that long. Helps when it hasn't been rained on though. Almost brand new. Almost. Time for another shade break. In the shade of the turbine. The final load into Sharon for 2021. Checking tires. Tracy thinks she, I need to narrate what I say is an award winning set of tracks up here. Well, the only reason why I think it would be of interest is because harvest can be so dangerous at times, and whether the truck was loaded or not makes no difference. But you gotta pay attention to what you're doing all the time. I think it's just over the top of this hill. And I don't know for a fact exactly what happened, but I've kind of put two and two together and I've got an idea what happened, what it was, I don't know. Little truck, big truck, semi, I, I don't know. But it's gonna be on the right hand side for starters. I think he ran off right here. See the tracks, see the fight. Yep, yep. Come back across the left, off the shoulder, off on that side, way down into the ditch. Come across oh, wow. he here with the craziest tracks I ever saw and went through the fence down there. Every time we finish a job, we have to clean our equipment up before we move it to the next job. So the header's done, and now Jim's working on the combine. So he's blowing everything off as much as he can. And then once that's done, we'll load everything up again and head it north. Goal is to have everything moved up to Chase tomorrow by nightfall. So wish us luck. You know, because because you guys have never met, right? Yep. And this is Boone. 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 And Darian just said they still have four days to go. Wow. You're just probably getting into a routine of harvest, though, right? Yes. <laughs> yes. I think what is this day day six for us? Is it? Yeah. Dealing with breakdowns, so you know, fun.
fun stuff. Fun stuff, that's mm -hmm. for sure. Where are you still west of Medicine? Yeah. West of Medicine. Out at Deerhead. Don't know anything about that. Get a good zoom of this little guy. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Chicken outfit. Well, you're just kind of frowning. <laughs> Can you smile? Can you smile for us? Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. I saw it smile earlier. What's the, what's the country? I've only, oh gosh, it was, 20, it was 25 years ago that I was west of Edison Lodge. What's, what's it like out there? Lots of hills. 